Saturday in the NBA. It'll be the Chicago Bulls facing off against the LA Lakers. Coming up next. And 2K Sports welcomes you to the NBA. Kevin Harlan here with Clark Kellogg. Glad to have you on board. It's the Chicago Bulls. Take Los Angeles Lakers. Let's check out Chicago's starting lineup. Michael Jordan is out there with John Paxson. Then there's Grant. Then it's Cartwright and Pippen. And for the Lakers, Devon's out there with Perkins. Then it's Magic Johnson. And there's Byron Scott and Worthy. So the Lakers win the tip. And here is Johnson. Worthy back and down. Guarded by Pippen. It's Worthy missing. Now the Bulls with it. Now let's send it out to Doris Burke, who caught up with head coach Mike Dunley. Doris? Kevin, even though these two teams have similar levels of success this season, Coach still feels like they have the upper hand going in. He told me we're stronger in the areas where it matters most, and I think you'll see that once this game unfolds. What he's referring to, we'll see as the game plays out, gentlemen. Great, Doris. Sounds like this one might come down to which Coach Clark can build a can build a better mousetrap. Especially when two clubs are operating at essentially the same level, Kevin. Now here's Johnson. Perkins with it. Johnson left side. Over Paxson. And the shot is good from Johnson. That's a good job to recognize the mismatch and then take advantage down low. And so here is Chicago. Here's Paxson. Tipped. And it's Johnson picking him up. Kept alive. Cartwright against Devots. Outside Pippen. Second shot opportunity. No good from Grant. Chicago on D. James Worthy on the way. Guarded by Pippen. Paxson against Johnson. Guarded by Paxson. And the basket by Johnson. He clearly had the speed advantage there, and he used it to burn the D for the sweet hoop. Nice play. Chicago with the ball. It's a three-point game. Grant with the ball. Covered by Perkins. 13 feet out. Kept alive. Here's Cartwright. Connects from in close. Snares the offensive rebound, then sends it home. Chicago on D. They trail by one. Johnson right side. Guarded by Paxson. Johnson, the pass to Worthy. Guarded by Pippen. Just three to shoot. With the fadeaway. Worthy, no good. The defense couldn't close out on the mid-range J, and the shooter made him pay. Paxson against Scott. The lob was a little misjudged, and he couldn't get control of it. Jump, and he slams it home. Here's the replay on the Sprite Slam camp. Great D leads to easy offense. Here's Paxson. 158 left in the first. Here's Jordan and the one-handed jam to finish. Plays like that are what makes this league so great. He's a special player. I don't care if you're a fan of another team. You have to admire someone, Clark, who can make those types of plays. And Magic Johnson with the slam. 
He went hard all the way right there. There's no back down in this guy. He's got one speed forward. Oh, is that nasty? Very. Here's Paxson. Got a great jump on the ball there, Kevin. Now Scott. Johnson outside. Pass to Worthy. Guarded by Pippen. Worthy kicks to Perkins. Just two to shoot. Here's Johnson. A miss three. You know, it might be the defense's game plan to force them to shoot from outside because they really sagged off on that one. Here's Grant, and it's Chicago scoring again. That's a pretty move there, Kevin. I like how he set that one up. He got the defender on his heels and then busted the quick turnaround. Here's Johnson. Scooped up. Perkins with a screen on Paxson. Johnson. And that's good. Laying it in. Johnson's got 10. Well, he's really been big for their team. Finding a way to consistently get it done on the scoreboard. Here's Paxson for the... Oh! oh man. That should be absolutely illegal. What an amazing long-distance alley-oop. If that doesn't get them fired up, heck, I don't know what will. Well, I'm surprised he could even see the hoop from there. Never mind his teammate. He just got it in the neighborhood, and that's all he needed to do. Such a creative finish. That was an impressive move. Here comes Michael Jordan. In our first quarter of play over, some good numbers on the board so far. Lakers ahead. They lead by three. Well, they're in attack mode now, Kevin. Every time they get the ball. They're coming right at you, looking for contact, and looking for buckets right at the 10. And we'll be back in just a moment. A closely contested game here at the start of the second quarter. Here's Armstrong. On the court right now, second quarter for the Bulls. Grant is out there with Purdue. Then there's Pippen. Then it's B.J. Armstrong and Jordan. And the basket by Purdue. You have to block this guy out, Kevin. He's just too active on the boards to be left alone. Smith against Armstrong. Smith the pass to Worthy. Guarded by Pippen. Tosses it up. Worthy, no good. Chicago trailing here. And here's Armstrong. Now here's Pippen. And Worthy picks him up defensively. Here's Jordan. And that misses. That would have put him up. And here's Los Angeles. Here's Scott. Buries the jumper to finish the break. Here's Armstrong. Outside Pippen. Worthy defending. Pippen kicks to Jordan. On the line. And Pippen with the basket. The assist from Michael Jordan. Pippen's got his first points of the night. Armstrong against Smith. The dump off. Worthy backing down. Guarded by Pippen. And it's Worthy again missing. Well, he faded away on it for no good reason. He shouldn't have made that shot harder than it had to be. Grant outside. Worthy against Pippen. Shoots over Worthy. Pippen misses. He's not giving an inch on defense. He really bothered that shot. Smith with it. James Worthy on the wing. 
right side worthy. Great finish in traffic. And the Lakers lead by three. He's just so gifted offensively. He's a tough guy to match up with. Pippen against Worthy. Off the screen. And then Pippen slams it in. Nice fundamental basketball. Get that screen in play solidly and then take it to the rim. Show a little patience, then zoom right in. Now here is Smith. Worthy back and down. Guarded by Pippen. Armstrong against Smith. They couldn't beat the buzzer. That's a turnover. Both teams deciding to change it up. A big possession here. Can they come back to take the lead? Johnson against Armstrong. He's guarded by Johnson. Ties it up, and this next one could give them the lead. And he gives them the lead. Here's Johnson. 12 points for him. Now Williams. Here's Devots. And great assist as he lays that one in. Devots has got his first pass. That's where you want to be getting the majority of your shots from on offense. And so here is Chicago. Only giving up six here in this quarter. Deflects the pass. Here's the break. Williams kicks to Johnson. Finished off the break. Johnson's got 14 points for the game. Good execution on the break leads to the nice bucket. Here's Armstrong. And it's Johnson picking him up. Here's Armstrong. Jump off pass. And Jordan gets it to go. Now that's great court vision, Kevin. Even when he was about to shoot, he was still able to spot the open man. Williams against Jordan. Stuffs it in. He made sure to get a little extra hang time there. Just to rub it in the defender's face a bit. Look out below. I wasn't sure he was ever going to come down. Johnson against Armstrong. And it's Johnson picking him up. Fades away. And it's Armstrong missing. He really needs to hit that consistently. Or they'll just keep letting him shoot it. And here is Johnson. Nails the buzzer beater. Ooh wee, Kevin. That was a big shot to extend their lead and send them into halftime with momentum. And we've reached halftime in this one. Check out the game for Johnson. 16 points and a steal. He is in complete control of this game. More from Los Angeles after this. No better way to spend a Saturday night than in the comfort of the one you love, the HP Halftime Report. The Lakers playing with poise so far. They've been getting good looks inside and knocking them down. Phenomenal efficiency. Through two quarters, Magic Johnson's in complete control. He's carrying the team, doing everything he can to put them over the top. And giving it their all, the Chicago Bulls. You can see the effort on the offensive glass, mixing it up, getting plenty of second shot opportunities. Michael Jordan off to a good start. After two, he's got six points, and everything is falling for him really efficient from the field. Some fantastic performances from these two early going, leading the way for their teams. And that'll do it for us. Thanks so much for joining us here. Enjoy the second half. And as the quarter begins, both teams have been trading blows like prize fighters. A close ball game. We've got Worthy. Perkins out there with Devots. And there's Byron Scott. They're the group Mike Dunleavy's going to start the second half with. Here's Scott. Pass to Johnson. He's picked up by Jordan. Johnson, the pass to Worthy. Guarded by Paxson. 
Shot clock at two. Kept alive. Paxson against Worthy. Left side Worthy. Two on the clock. And he makes it look so easy. Laying it right in. Worthy's got his second basket of the game. Bulls trail by seven. Paxson with the ball. No points for him. Pippen a screen on Perkins. Grant against Perkins. 18 feet away. Blocked. This is one of the key reasons why they're losing. You have to get more production out of your core star players. And Johnson puts it in. Johnson's got 18 points in the game. When he gets it going like this, you've got to double team it. That's your only hope. Outside Jordan. Defended by Scott. And slam dunk by Jordan. He's been getting after it offensively, but they're still trailing here. One guy can only do so much. Paxson against Johnson. He is guarded by Cartwright. Baseline jumper. And the Lakers tap on two more. We've seen them make three of their first four shots. That's good shooting to jumpstart them here. Here's Paxson. 2.49 left in the third. Jordan up top. Defended by Scott. The 10-footer. Cartwright gets the bucket. And they've got it to within seven. Here's Johnson. He's got 18. Johnson missing again. An outstanding pick there, and he still couldn't get the basket. Next time he gets a look that good, he's got to make it count. Lakers leading by seven. Rips in the ferocious chance. Who says your point guard isn't supposed to throw it down? Well, who no need for him to look for an open man? He can do it all by himself. Solo. And the first time out of the game called for Chicago. And the Bulls making a change here. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Nine-point game. To get back into this game, Kevin, they need to really concentrate on limiting the turnovers. I mean, it hasn't been terrible for them, but it's still hurting their cause. He's picked up by Jordan. Johnson kicks it over to Worthy. Shot clock at five. Four seconds left. Can't hit. Now Chicago takes it the other way. The defense couldn't close out on the mid-range, Jay, and the shooter made him pay. Boy, the turnovers are piling up pretty quickly here. We've seen them doing quite a bit of sloppy ball handling. Mm -hmm. That's their third turnover in this quarter. Now here's Johnson. Guarded by Paxson. Just four to shoot. And that one barely misses as he draws contact. Two free throws coming up. Yeah, it's a no-brainer. you got to stop the layup there. Make him earn his points from the line. The first one falls, so both teams making some changes here. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Here's Armstrong. 54 seconds left in the third quarter. Jordan against Smith. Devots against Purdue. Here's Jordan. And the Bulls with another miss. That's really not the kind of performance that his team needs from him here in this quarter. Now here's Johnson. He's got 22. 
guarded by Jordan. Johnson against Jordan. A second left. Johnson can't get it to go. Now here's Jordan. Eight points for him. To the right wing. To end the drought, here's King, and he hits that one from down low. Beautiful delivery with the bounce pass. He kept it away from the defense, which set up the shot murder. And we are heading into the fourth. Lots of production in this one as we conclude the third. Check out the game for Johnson. 22 points, and he's had a steal in there, too. He's rolling, trying to put them on his back right here. Lakers lead by nine. And now let's send it to our sideline reporter, Doris Burke, for our Sprite Spark of the game. Doris? For the Lakers, the Sprite Spark has been from the good work at the point. He came out of the locker room, fired up, and turned in a tremendous first quarter. We'll see if he has more of the same in the fourth, guys. Over to you. Doris, thanks. And he's clearly Clark set in motion. Things his coach wanted them to do. Well, he's been a huge spark plug out there today. Here's Johnson. So for Chicago right now, they've got Purdue. Grant is out there with Pippen. Then it's B.J. Armstrong and Jordan. Now here's Johnson. He's covered by Armstrong. Kept alive, Johnson. Goes up again. It's a little short, but gets the friendly roll. Johnson's got 24. Here is Armstrong. And it's good assisting on the play was Jordan. Kicked it to the right guy at the right time. That's a good pass. Lakers leading by nine. Johnson outside. Got a piece of it. Stolen by Pippen. And Kev, that's only his first giveaway for the game. Mm. Takes it up. Cans the Pardon tough me. double clutch layup. Here's Johnson. He's covered by Armstrong. Armstrong against Johnson. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. Here's Smith. Buries the triple. Smith's got his first three points of the game. They're not going to run that play very often. But hey, they'll take it. Way to notch that three. Wasn't careful with his position. He gets nailed with the backcourt violation. So both teams changing it up here. Here's Johnson. The open shot by Worthy. Grant gets the rebound. No defense there to bother the shot, and he still misfired. His coach does not look happy. And here's Paxson. The runner, and the Bulls tack on two more. Here's Johnson. 2.36 left to the fourth. Guarded by Paxson. Devon sets a screen. Hit the teardrop, and the shot is good from Johnson. Johnson's got his first basket of the night. Not a lot of time left for the Bulls in this one. Trailing by 10. Chicago calls timeout. They're behind by 10. 2-12 left in the game. A moment to check in with Doris Burke. Doris? Hey, Kevin, during that last break, I heard Phil Jackson as he addressed his basketball team. He was clearly fuming. He told them, you guys look like you're sleepwalking out there. He said, I don't know if you rolled out of the wrong side of the bed this morning or what, but we've got to step up and wake up. Guys? Both teams will make substitutions. That's the way to make sure. 
throw that thing down with two hands for the Monster Jam. What a sight it is to see when he hammers it home. That's like exactly what it was, a tomahawk hammer. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Here's Johnson. Here's Worthy. The shot misses. Now Chicago takes it the other way. He continues to struggle from the field. But luckily for him and his team, his teammates have been able to pick him up and get the job done. Off on the first. Sinks the second, and that narrows the gap to seven. They can't afford too many missed free throws, Kev. They need every point they can get. Now Johnson. Johnson, double team. Back to D-Box. He dumps it off. Five to shoot. Here's Worthy. Gets it to go. Worthy's got his third bucket of the night. His shooting so far has been a bit spotty. So hopefully that's a sign that he's back on track. Chicago calls timeout. They're trailing by nine. 119 left in the fourth. Paxson against Johnson. Right side, Jordan. Pass to Pippen. That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. Here's Johnson. 108 left in the game. Guarded by Paxson. Devon's a screen on Jordan. Scott, basket is good. The assist from Johnson. And the Lakers lead by nine. Right on the verge of victory now. They don't need much more than to just take care of the basketball. Outside Jordan. And here's Los Angeles. Here's Scott. And here is Johnson. He's picked up by Pippen. Shot clock at five. Johnson inside. Can't get it. Here comes Paxson. Leads him in. Stolen away. And so the Lakers take the win. They came, they saw, they conquered. Hey, Kevin, to me, any win is a good win. Thanks for joining us for this presentation of NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. For Doris Burke and the whole crew and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan saying see you next time. But first, let's check out the Jordan Grant player of the game. I can't change my frame of mind, it's game time I've been at it jumping, I got hang time Cause I'm a dude that can't lose the game mind It's game time, game time, game time I can't change my frame of mind, it's game time I've been had it jumping, I got hang time That's why I ball and go hard at the same time It's game time, but ain't no games getting played Me going broke, it's like Michael Jordan getting brave I do my thing, my chain, frozen lemonade The ice in my brightener remind me of frozen minute maid